loves me not. He loves me? He loves me not. He loves me. Yes, I'm sure he loves me. This is real bad, Mina. Come on. You're worrying about nothing. He's probably just blocking out the sun. It's dusk. There is no sun. True. But don't feel too down. For all you know, he might just be playing his guitar. No way. I can see it now. She's totally into him. She'll be making a move. She'll be... <sighs> That's it. I'm depressed. Come on. You don't have anything to worry about. Tristan and Simone have nothing in common. All she's interested in is glitter lip gloss gossip and movie stars. But she's also interested in karate. Okay, but above all, she adores pajama parties. Mina, you're a genius. Huh? I'll explain later. Lou, you there? Lou? Hmm? <clears throat> hey, Mom, you busy? Can we talk? There it is. I got to the end of the level. Mom, I've been thinking. Good for you, honey. Man, take that. You know, I've just realized I don't have many friends, and that's not a good thing at my age. Yep. Gotcha! Thought you could beat me, huh? So, I'd like to invite some girls over for a PJ party. Yes! I psyched ya! <laughs> that okay? Uh, what? A PJ party? Yeah. What a great idea! We can all make popcorn, watch a scary movie, and... Um, Mom, PJ parties are usually for kids, not adults. What? Mm -mm. Oh, no! Oh, please, Luli, let me come. I've always wanted to go to one of those parties. Promise I'll be quiet. So, Lou, are you going to tell me why you think I'm such a genius? Oh, yeah. I have a pajama party. Simone comes. We play truth or dare. And then I ask her the question. What were you doing around at Tristan's on Thursday night? And she tells the truth. Ta-da! <laughs> what if she chooses dare, though? Hmm. We won't give her the choice. Yeah. You know, this might just work. Hmm. Now we invite them. I really surprised myself. So then? You know, Lou, I didn't think PJ parties were your thing. Uh, yeah. So, Simone, how about it? Sounds like a cool idea to me. Don't have anything else to do. Wait. Actually, I meant... I, I thought... So we'll be there at eight, huh? Mm -hmm. Awesome! A whole night without adults! Without adults? Actually, I... Don't tell me you've got all these coming. Uh... No, no, of course not. Cool. See you then. See ya. Yeah, see ya. Hmm. Well? Well, we have three problems. One, Simone's coming with her groupies. Two, we're gonna have to stop said groupies from butting in. And three, my mom wants to party too. And that's definitely not cool. Aren't your parents mm. having a party this Saturday? Mm. Some boring dinner with a bunch of my dad's pals from work. Mina, did I ever tell you you're a genius? <laughs> I don't think your father would be too pleased about us inviting someone he hardly even knows. Mom, can I ask you a question? Of course, honey. Why is it always Dad who gets to choose who comes over? Hmm? 8.30? Great. Shall I bring nibbles? No, you sure? It's real nice of you to invite me, Joss. See you Saturday, then. Lou, I've got bad news. Oh, yeah? Mina's mom invited me over, and I said yes. But it's Saturday night, the day of your party. I can't go. I'm sorry. When the time comes for your folks to go it alone, you've got to be ready. You can't hold them back. Sometimes, Luli, you can be so grown up. Welcome to our home. Oh, shoot. 
Is this a costume party? Uh, I'm sorry. This isn't a costume party. Mm -mm. Right. Well, I, um, I brought some music. Check it out, girls. Do you like my new PJs? But they're the same as last time. No, those ones were pink. Oh? These are this season's pink. Can't you tell? <laughs> I can't take much more of this. Do something before I start freaking. Don't worry. Time for planning. So, guys, who's up for a game of truth or dare? Oh? Oh, no. Games are for babies. Why don't we put on a movie instead? And I've got just the one for us to watch. Cool! Yeah, great! <gasps> But you can take your choice. I mean, what I'm saying, but I will not Do you mind if I put something else on? Sure, go ahead. <laughs> so I guess you don't like rock, huh? The food's ready. Oh, great. <laughs> May I congratulate you on your choice of guests. <laughs> At least she's a better dancer than your friends. <laughs> what a cute little sandwich. Oh. Oh. oh, yes, I read his latest book. His perspective is definitely diminishing. In fact, his vision of structuralism in modern society is quite vulgar. <laughs> What's up now? Uh, nothing. Elizabeth, dearest, please say you will be mine for the rest of our days. Oh, I don't know. After all, you asked So, him. how about we check out a mega Indeed, zombie horror movie instead? Conquer all. You obviously haven't met my father. Prepare to be exterminated, you curdled chunk of cheese. Don't bet on it, you trashed out tomato. Ah, <clears throat> oh, shoot. Well, girl, there's no doubt about it. This is the crummiest evening you've had in your entire career as a human being. Huh? An amazing hunt? <laughs> I love you. Me too. I'll love you forever. This is as cool as frosty pink nail gloss with glitters, and it's so romantic. Right. So what do we do now? How about a pillow fight? Yeah! yeah! Take a hold. Yeah. Uh -huh. okay. What the? What the? Ow. <laughs> Robert's incredibly expensive pinball machine. Nobody's allowed to touch it. You mean he has a legendary pinball machine in his home and no one plays it? No, no one. You want to try it? Uh, come on, what harm can it do you? Listen up. Ow. If we don't play truth or dare this minute, there's no telling what I'll do. Uh -huh. You see, sweet talking works wonders. Huh? Hmm. You're right. This is fun. You mean this is the first time you've ever played? Uh, yes. But what did you do in the evenings when you were a kid? My homework. Right. Your teenage years must have been real fun. Funny you should say that. That's exactly what I was just thinking. Over there, my cat! So, Simone, truth or dare? Huh? Um, uh, truth? All right, so what shall I ask? Let's see. Ah, uh, yes. What were you doing at Tristan's on Thursday? Oh, Tristan asked me to help him with his math homework as I'm top of the class, so I went over to his place. That's it? Yeah, that's it. What about the drapes? Why did he close them? It was my idea. I wanted to see them. <laughs> They're real gross. They have little guitars all over. 
just as I thought. Nothing to stress about. Why do you ask? Do you love him? Hmm? Uh, I'm supposed to be doing the asking, not you. I... I choose Dara! Okay, you have to call Tristan right now and tell him you're in love with him. <laughs> Come on! Oh, oh, oh. Oh. But what about the pajama party? We were just getting started. Well, it's over now. This is my dare. Oh. Wow, you're real good at foosball. You're only saying that to be nice. Oh, trust me, it's not my nature. <laughs> <laughs> Lou, what's up, honey? You okay? Um, how'd you like to go to a pajama party, Joss? But what about Robert's party and all his guests? Your choice. Mm. You know what, Mom? Tristan has drapes with guitar patterns on them. That's cool. Wow. I know. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha